boards. Raises the revs. The world will get ready. And he's underway and he's off for the four-wheel drive. Traction digs into the tarmac. It goes over the Indianapolis yard of bricks as he flings it into the first corner. He's running on tarmac on the forest tires on the tarmac. He's got huge suspension travel, of course, compared with full tarmac spec. But for me, the pitch and the yaw and the way that the car moves around makes it look even better on the tarmac. Here at Goodwood, look at that. Elvin Evans, ladies and gentlemen. Got a bit on the grass there, I think. And uh, but he's really donating that car beautifully. Look, when he gets it hooked up there, it's almost turning on the spot. It's not donating round the point. It's almost like just rotating. A clever dips inside that car, of course. The uh, the, uh, the the transmission technology nowadays is absolutely oh. wondrous. He's, he's hard on the brakes into Vulcan Corner. Gives it a flick of the handbrake. Wow. Round he goes and on his way. Proper rallying, proper job. They've got so much more power than they did a couple of years ago with the new regulations in the World Rally Championship. So they're nudging, you know, 350, maybe a little bit more horsepower. Bags of torque from just the small 1.6 litre turbocharged engine, but the commitment and the downforce that the uh, the car installs into the driver is quite something. We are in a true golden age.